One night, you have an accident. Sirens echo through the streets. An urgent blood transfusion must be done. The paramedics notify the hospital. In the emergency room, doctors quickly prepare. When you arrive at the hospital, there is worry in the doctor's eyes. They are talking among themselves. His blood exists in only a few people in the world. This is not a movie scene. This is the daily reality of people who carry Rach Null, also known as Golden Blood. Fewer than 50 confirmed people exist in the world. And for them, life is constantly on edge. So what makes this blood so special, and at the same time deadly? Every day, hundreds of people cling to life with blood transfusions. In the United States alone, 32,000 units of blood are transfused daily. Accidents, surgeries, wars, and more. Even if transfusion stopped for just one day, hundreds of people would lose their lives. But there is an important question. Why can't everyone give blood to each other? Because on the surface of our red blood cells are tiny structures called antigens. These give our immune system the information of self or foreign. When you receive the wrong blood, your body thinks the new cells are enemies. The result? The cells break apart, blood vessels become blocked, kidneys fail, even death can occur. Here's what we need to note. In type A, there is the A antigen and antibodies against B. In type B, the situation is the opposite. B antigen and antibodies against A. In type AB, both A and B antigens are present, but there are no antibodies. That's why it is the universal recipient. In type O, no antigens are present, but there are antibodies against A and B. That's why it is the universal donor. And then there is the RH system, especially the D antigen. If there is the D antigen, it is positive. If not, it is negative. That is why we talk about eight main blood types. But this is only the visible part of the iceberg. Scientists have identified more than 33 different systems and hundreds of antigens. So in reality, our blood is one of millions of different combinations. Why is this important? Because sometimes that tiny difference can be a matter of life and death. For example, the VEL antigen. 99.9% .9 of people have it, but 0.1% do not. Those rare people, if they mistakenly receive VEL-positive blood, can die due to kidney failure. So saying, I am O positive is not enough. Under your blood, there are hundreds of variations. And the extreme point of these variations is RH null. RH null blood means blood that carries none of the 61 antigens in the RH system. It seems impossible, but it exists in the world. And fewer than 50 confirmed people in the world have it. Why do doctors call this golden blood? Because in patients where no other blood is compatible, it can be used. For people with rare combinations, this blood can be the only lifesaver. But the blood that is a savior for others is a mortal risk for its carriers, because they can only receive blood from other RH null individuals. The story of a Swiss Rage Null carrier shows this reality strikingly. As a child, he could not go to summer camp. He was not allowed to do sports, because even a small fall could be fatal. As an adult, his travels were also restricted. It was impossible to go to countries without modern hospitals. So what's the solution? Twice a year, he donates his own blood to be stored. But this is also limited. Because RH antigens normally keep the red blood cell membrane stable. Without them, 
the cells break apart more quickly. This leads to hemolytic anemia, fatigue, shortness of breath, jaundice. So you have the most valuable blood, but your own body struggles to keep that blood healthy. Let's say on the other side of the world, a baby needs RH null blood to survive. You donated, but it doesn't end there because transporting this blood is a nightmare. Fresh blood lasts only four weeks. It must be kept at four degrees Celsius, and if one customs paper is missing, the blood can wait for days and become useless. Some countries do not accept foreign blood. For example, the UAE only accepts blood from Gulf countries. A baby's life may depend on the signature of a border officer. One day, your phone rings. A baby's life is in danger. We need your blood. What would you do? Would you leave your job? Cut your vacation short? Walk out of your own wedding? Because no one else can help. This is the responsibility RH null carriers live with. On one hand, they carry a gift unique in the world. But on the other, they must always be ready for their entire lives. Let's not forget, blood donation is not only vital for rare blood groups, but for all of us. Since the 1800s, millions of lives have been saved. In peacetime, traffic accidents, births, surgeries. In wars, millions of soldiers. For example, in World War II, just for the Normandy invasion, 50,000 units of blood were needed. Hundreds of thousands of units were shipped from the U.S. to Europe. Today, the same system keeps millions alive. Golden blood reminds us of this. Every blood is valuable. The single unit you donate can give someone else a second life. Maybe you don't have the rarest blood in the world, but your donation could be as valuable as gold for someone else. And maybe one day, your blood will be the one that saves a life. If you enjoy scientific stories like this, from the mysteries of blood groups to the secrets of the universe, subscribe to my channel, because there is so much more to learn here.